What? Yeah, I learned what a condom was. Why are you so heavy, first of all? And who was talking about that in your school? We had help today, and some lady, she was talking about what a condom was. To a second grader? Like, what she said it was? She said it was a hat, but only for the people named Jimmy. What? That's not what it is, Sean. That was a condom. Condom is something I should have used so you wouldn't be here talking stupid right now. That's what a condom is. That's what a condom is. She said if you also wear it, it will help you not to study. What the hell do studying got to do with it? A condom will help you not get no STDs, and I think that's short for studying. Do it look like I give a fuck? Do it look like I give a fuck or I don't? You're wrong again. A condom is something that you use to protect yourself against dirty girls. You want to know something? Ask your father. Oh, well, I know you wear a condom all the time. What makes you say that? Because all your girls dirty. Get the f- Dad. Yo. Where we going? To the lodge, man. Oh! What's wrong with you? It's born there. Okay. Then I be sweating. Then the phones be dying. First of all, Sean, why are you sweating? What, you inside the dryer? And last time I had to wash your clothes in the sink because you ain't want to go to the laundromat. Then you ain't had no clean shirt to go to school. I had to bring your suit up there. All the kids calling you little church boy. No, we're not doing it again. And I don't know what point I just made, but guess what? What? I made it. Sit you behind back and take the ride. Why can't somebody just come to our house and wash our laundry for us? Who you know do that? My boys that do your dirty laundry. Oh, yeah? Yeah. Do they wash your drawers? Yes. Do they wash your socks? Yes. I got a question. Do they wash your company drawers? They don't wash your company drawers. And why not? Because they don't wash parachutes. What the f***? not believe me got a jail. Oh, hold on. Me got a jail? Yeah. When he get out? What, you sleep under a rock? He came out last night. He was at the sixth game and everything. First of all, you're hype. Second of all, everybody hype. He talking about free meat. Nobody was seeing his free gee when I got out of jail. Was they? Nobody was hype when you got a jail because you went to jail for stealing from Rite Aid. Shit, I was stealing from Rite Aid for you. You the one coughing in my ear all night, Sean. I wasn't paying no eleven dollars and twenty two cents for that little bottle of children's time law. What you talking about? But you paid eleven twenty two anyway. What? Eleven to twenty two months in jail. Do it look like I give a fuck? Do it look like I give a fuck because I don't, Sean. I did my time like a man. Okay? Know that. That don't make you cool. You told me not to lie or steal. Then you doing both right now. Well, whatever. Dad, just say it. You jealous of me. Sean, what do I got to be jealous of Meek for, Sean? Anything Meek should be jealous of me, okay? Sit back. <laughs> Imagine that. That's like you going on a date with a girl under 250 pounds. Dang. That yeah. Dad, you got, I told you I had no gas. You got me driving over. I don't even know where we at. Let's just drive down here a couple more blocks, man. Stop fucking complaining, man. You said a couple more blocks like 10 blocks ago, though, Dad. I told you I had to take Sean somewhere. Do it look like I give a fuck? Dad, Do it look like I late. give a fuck? Sean, be quiet. I'm dropping pop up off of here. That's the point. I could have been there practice an hour ago. Do it look like I give a fuck? Don't look like I give a fuck because I don't. You and Papa will also be walking an hour ago now, cause they shit. Before I be walking, both y'all be the fuck out this car. <sighs> shit. You better catch an Uber. Where are you going at anyway? Just drop me off at my shorty house down here, man. Why we pay for this shorty stuff? Shit, she ain't big as your daddy girls. I hope not. What the fuck you mean you hope not? Hey man, what the fuck? Dad, I don't want to live in Philly no more. Why not? Because there's a lot of people getting killed. People get killed everywhere, Sean. Moving out of Philly ain't gonna change that. But that's beside the point. Why don't people get killed anyway? Why don't LeBron James go to the Lakers? I don't know. Or why every time I see Snoop Dogg on TV, I don't know if he's hiding that. I don't know. Dig with your answer. I don't know either. But Dad, one of these days, are you gonna get killed? What? Are you gonna get killed? Is Meek Mills in the house listening to Drake album? No. Is anybody gonna beat the Gold State Wars this year? No. So that's the same answer I'm gonna give you. All I wanna do is live my best life, son, to be there for you. I'm innocent. I ain't nobody gonna kill me. But innocent people get killed too. Even cops kill innocent people. Innocent people also eat banana pudding with strawberries in it. What? And I don't know what point I just made, but I made it. I don't know. Just pray, son. That's all you can do. Moving ain't gonna change nothing. But Dad, one more question. One more question. What's up? Is cops good guys or bad guys? <laughs>
wrong with you? Dad, I'm pissed. What's wrong? We found out that Drake was hiring his son. And that means if Drake hired his son, that means you hired me. What the hell that got to do with me, Sean? Dad, Drake is a millionaire. And if he can't afford to take care of his son, I know your broke self can't afford to take care of me. Sean, you with me every day. How can I possibly be hiring you? That's the side point. You don't know none of my friends, and I don't know none of yours. Do it look like I give a fuck? Do it look like I give a fuck, I don't. I don't know none of your friends because I don't like your friends. You don't know none of my friends because they're too old to talk to you anyway, and they don't want to talk to you. You keep listening to what Pusha T saying, you're going to get your teeth pushed back. How about that? Yeah, Look at my face. Yeah, all right. You know the abbrevi abbreviation of Drake Hotter Son? And what is that? DHS. And that's why I'm going to call if you put your hands on me. Sean, sure. I'm not hiding you. Yes, you are. And you're also hiding that game that you play every night. What game I play every night? Hunger, Hunger, Hippo. Get your hands on the... What the hell is a substitute? A girl that come to your room and you pay her and then she teach you stuff. And what's she teaching me, Sean? I don't know. You the one who's paying her, though. Do it look like I give a fuck? Do it look like I give a fuck and I don't? What happened in Vegas is my business. That's first of all. Second of all, I'm starting to think you mean prostitute. No, I'm not talking about a prostitute. I'm talking about a substitute. Because prostitute got something to do with cancer. I'm not stupid. That's prostate! You don't even know what you're talking about right now. Tell me I got something to do with cancer. What are you talking about? That's the side point. If you got enough money to pay us substitute you got enough money to take me down in vegas with you instead of leaving me home with that ugly girl what girl the girl that got the body shaped like a beanbag chair what the shut up sean all you do is try to bet on people shut up because i ain't had no prostitute no substitute and i ain't gonna give you no solution of what the hell i was doing in vegas on my trip and i don't know what point i just made but guess what what i made it just sit back matter of fact let's go we're going to playground now no i'm good now enjoy get the Put the head in, girl. What you think I came out here for? What? What? Who that girl in the bathroom crying? What's she? What is she crying for? Talk about you gave her crabs for Mother's Day. Crabs? Are you crazy? I got no crabs. That's the side point. I been asking you for crabs all weekend. Sean, first of all, do it look like I give a fuck? Do it look like I give a fuck? Cause I don't. She ain't talking about no kind of crabs. Then what kind of crabs she talking about? She talking about the ones you get from dirty people. Oh, I guess you. Then we talk about the same crabs. Cause every time you bring crabs here, you never clean them. What? So what is you talking about? And it's not like y'all been eating crabs. It's not like what? It's not like y'all been watching Little Mermaid in 3D. That's what it's not like. And everything popped out the TV. How about I pop your ass? Get out of my room and bring her in here. I ain't touch her. Why not? Because she said she itching. Itching from what? Itching probably from when you brought her from cooking the Get your ass out of my room! Dad, I'm hungry. I'm gonna make some cereal when you get home. Ain't no milk. Well, make some oodles and noodles. Neither is it water. How we got no water, Sean? Did you take a bath today? Yep. Then we got water, don't we? You put your pot in the sink and you use the spigot water. I don't like spigot water. I like spring water. Well, since you like spring water so much, guess what I like? What? Do it look like I give a fuck? Do it look like I give a fuck and I don't. Since you like spring water so much, it's raining outside, ain't it? Yeah. And it's technically spring. How about you put your pot in the porch and the owl you have spring water? Wow, Dad. You really outdone yourself. And I'm about to undo your teeth if you keep talking. Get out of my face. You make a peanut butter jelly when you get home. Ain't no bread. And you should never sold all our food stamps. I sold our food stamps so you had toilet paper to wipe your ass with. Or two pace to brush them dirty teeth. What's more important, you eating or our hygiene? What? And I don't know what point I just made, but guess what? What? I made it. Then sit back, I'll cook you something when I get home. You said that last night, but you wound up giving me two cups of NyQuil. And I woke up six o'clock in the morning. Well, tonight I'm gonna give you three cups and so you're gonna wake up in school. How about that? Sit back. I was camp, though. What the hell is wrong with you? I'm not ever, ever going back to that camp, ever. Why? Because every time my kid get dropped off, they get dropped off by their mom, and they Why can't I just get dropped off by both? Because I'm not with your mom. What are Why? you talking about? Why? Why? Because your mom with Daryl, and you know that. That's why you acting crazy. Oh, yeah. Speaking of Mr. Daryl, he said I don't got to call him Mr. Daryl no more. Just call him Daddy. First of all, pause, okay? When you're over five years old, don't ever call another man Daddy. Second of all, if you call him Daddy, I'm going to be calling you Collect. Why? Because I'm going to be in jail for knocking you and Daryl teeth out. That's why. Don't play with me. That's what's the I hear my mom calling him daddy every night, so I'm not the only eyeball in the house. TMI, Sean. And do it look like I give a fuck? Because I don't. Your mom used to call me daddy, too, until she got that overnight shift working in the back of the DMC. What's the DMC? Daryl Mom's car. That's what it is. Sit your ass back. I'm be the only person calling you daddy. Yeah, you right, Dad. I don't want to call him what my mom call him anyway. You said she called him daddy, so what are you talking about? But big... Get to that throat! I've been trying to figure this out. I kissed you and I rocked you. I loved you. I'm the
the first day that I crossed you once more. So